welcome to Off the Cuff. I'm Corey Knowles. We're here on February 7th, and I'm visiting with Pam Trammell, the director of Keller Public Library. How are you doing today, Pam? Good morning. I'm great. How are you? Doing good. Thank doing you for having me. You bet. I uh, understand you guys have a fashion show coming up. It is coming up. It'll be here very soon, Monday, March the 12th. This is the annual Friends of the Library fashion show and dinner. This is the, the largest event of the year for the Friends of the Library. And it's it's a big event. The tic the tickets are on sale now. Okay. At the library, they are still twenty dollars. So I would encourage everyone to come in and get one early because they always sell out ahead of time. Uh -huh. It's Monday, March the twelfth at six thirty at the Elks, and all of the proceeds come back to the library. Oh, okay. Uh, well, that's great. All of the proceeds from the friends fundraisers and membership fees are used to support the library. They underwrite all of our children's programs and help us purchase items that are above and beyond the scope of our budget. Yes. Well, that's great. Boy, it's great to have an organization like that. A lot of times don't. It's A lot of libraries don't have a friends. Mm -hmm. The best libraries have a friends of the libraries oh, organization. I'll bet. I'll bet. That's wonderful. That really is. Now, there are uh, area businesses involved with that as well, aren't there? The local vendors, there are. Uh, they uh, supply fashions mm -hmm. that the models show that evening. And uh, so we do have a lot of community support. We have a lot of, uh, there will be attendees from all over the county who look forward to this every year. It's a big event. Well, that's great. I know, I know that uh, a couple of people involved with friends always come in and do something on it as well because they, they get pretty excited about it. This it is. is. Deal. It's, it's, a, it's a great way to kick off springtime. Come in and see what, what the local merchants have yeah. for spring. Well, that's great. That's great. Get people to shop locally. And have a good dinner and uh, see a lot of Friends. That's right. You usually have pretty good attendance. <laughs> Wonderful attendance. That's what I was thinking. The Elks will be, will be full. Okay. And as I said, the tickets will, will probably sell out ahead of time. They usually do. So Get them uh, quick. Get them. <laughs> come on in and get your ticket while we have them. Okay. Well, that's great. Uh, what else you guys have going on with the library right now? Well, it's February, but it's not too early to begin planning for our summer reading program because mm -hmm. that's huge. And we put a lot of preparation and planning mm -hmm. goes into providing that six-week program during the summer, and it's it's a huge event. We'll have children from 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 all over the area mm -hmm. who will who look forward to that every year. And our theme this year is Dream Big, Read, oh. and so we'll be drawing from uh, the night. Mm -hmm. We'll have uh, decorations and the sounds and and stories and and uh, that all have to do with nighttime. So we've ordered lots of new books. We're already planning our uh, our programs and our songs uh -huh. and our skits and we've ordered prizes and, and busy uh, stuff. we want to encourage encourage them to read and hopefully this will be a theme that they will find enjoyment in reading about. Well that's great. That's great. You guys also have a weekly reading. We have a weekly story hour every Tuesday morning and um, you don't have to uh, have a library card to attend. It's every Tuesday at 10:15, and we've we've used that story hour as a way to partner with the community, mm -hmm. and we involve guest readers each week. We have a different uh, member of our community who will read and kind of plan the theme, and we help them with yeah. the craft. You've had some neat ones over the years. Oh, we've had we've we we've, we've had the the fire chief, and we've had. The, we have retired teachers, and um, we have conservation agents, and so so each one brings a different area yeah. to the program, and the children love it, and oh, it gives great. them a variety. Oh, so yeah. if anybody would be interested in being a guest reader, just call or come by, and we'd love to, we'd love to have them. Oh, that's great! That's great. The friends of the library underwrite. This is one thing that they do with their funds is they underwrite the story hour and the summer reading. As well. well, that's wonderful because those programs can get costly. I they, imagine. Well, they sure can. You know, that's that's wonderful. Well, Pam, I sure appreciate you coming Thank by you today for Enjoy having me. I, I appreciate the opportunity to talk about the library. We always have something going on. There's always something going on, <laughs> and always library. something good to read. That's right, always <laughs> something good to read. Well, I'd like to thank everyone for tuning in to watch Off the Cuff today. I'm Corey Knowles, and we'll see you back here next week. Thanks for watching.